Welcome to our Virtual Law Legal Analysis Series. In today's episode, we will discuss the purpose, salient features, advantages, issues and implementations of Republic Act 9165. Let's dive right into it. Republic Act No. 9165, also known as the Comprehensive Dangerous Drugs Act of 2002, is the law that governs the illegal drug trade in the Philippines. It was enacted on June 7, 2002, and repealed Republic Act No. 6425, the Dangerous Drugs Act of 1972. The purpose of RAW 9165 is to provide for a comprehensive and integrated approach in the campaign against the proliferation of dangerous drugs and the rehabilitation of drug dependence. It aims to achieve this goal by Defining dangerous drugs and establishing penalties for offenses related to them. Creating the Dangerous Drugs Board, DDB, and the Philippine Drug Enforcement Agency, PIA, to enforce the law. Providing for the treatment and rehabilitation of drug dependence. Raising awareness about the dangers of drug abuse. The salient features of RON 9165 include The classification of dangerous drugs into four schedules based on their potential for abuse and addiction. The establishment of the DDB and the PIA. The creation of the Dangerous Drugs Treatment and Rehabilitation Centers, CDTRCS. The imposition of heavy penalties for drug-related offenses. The provision for the forfeiture of assets acquired from the proceeds of drug trafficking. The advantages of RON 9165 include It has strengthened the government's ability to combat the illegal drug trade. It has increased awareness about the dangers of drug abuse. It has provided treatment and rehabilitation services to drug dependents. It has led to the confiscation of drug-related assets. However, there are also some issues with RON 9165, such as The high penalties for drug-related offenses have led to some cases of wrongful conviction. The lack of resources has hampered the implementation of the law. The law has been used to target political opponents and critics of the government. Despite these issues, RON 9165 remains an important piece of legislation in the Philippines' fight against the illegal drug trade. It has helped to reduce the availability of drugs and to increase the number of people seeking treatment for drug addiction. However, more needs to be done to ensure that the law is implemented effectively and that its provisions are not abused. Here are some of the implementations of RAW 9165. The DEB has been conducting public awareness campaigns about the dangers of drug abuse. The PIA has been conducting raids and arrests of drug traffickers and users. The CDTRCS have been providing treatment and rehabilitation services to drug dependents. The government has been working with other countries to combat the illegal drug trade. The implementation of RON 9165 is a complex and challenging task. However, it is an important one, and the government is committed to making it a success. That's all for this episode. What do you think about the topic? Feel free to comment and suggest what topic you want us to discuss on the next video. Stay tuned for more legal insights in our future episode. Remember, Understanding the law helps us comprehend the intricacies of our legal system. See you next time. Like and subscribe.